Well, we're gonna make a little bit of a pit stop. We're gonna make a little side side venture to see somebody real quick. We just gotta we gotta find where their house is at. It's a little bit a little bit up a ways, a little still. Just a little bit. A little bit. Is it on this road, at least? Yeah, well, it'll be a left-hand turn in point four. Point four. It wasn't too far off the beaten hey path, so. <laughs> hey, y'all. We got our balloon. What's up, yo? Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Uh. Yeah. Oh, man. Yep, you. A little bit further. Came from the Crocker meetup. Gonna go pay special fan a little bit of a visit. Is it across this? Uh, keep going straight. Straight. Oh, bang on. That's a lot of swings. What do you mean? Swings. Oh, that is a lot of swings. I heard about this person's peppers and garden and everything, and we figured we had to drive eight hours to come see it for ourselves because there's just no way that this person can produce this many peppers and vegetables out of their backyard in town. And I thought she was full of it. Uh. Woo! We're here. Oh man, there's crazy people driving all around here. I don't know if we should have stopped or not. <laughs> guys, I think we should get back in the car. There's, there's some crazy guy who just yelled at us, told us to get out of his street. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> yeah, really. He looked like, he looked like a Kyle though. <laughs> <laughs> he looked like Kyle. He looked like a Kyle. <laughs> I don't know. You guys guess who we're stopping by to see yet? If you guys watch the channel, you'll know. I don't know which which way to go. Should we go this the front door? Oh! I'm gonna knock the little girl off. <laughs> Hello! Uh, I don't know who it is. Oh my goodness! Hello! Hi, Hello. Nice to meet you. I'll give you a handshake and then a We're here to see Miss Paula! Hi guys! Hi! Hi! How are you? I'm good. <laughs> How oh, how you doing? Dialing? I'm good. Yeah. How are you? Did you guys have a good time? We did. Yeah, we did. Two hours later. I know. Oh what man, she wasn't lying. She did get a lot of peppers. What are you guys? You gonna make salsa for the next couple years or what? Uh, oh, no, there's over a hundred jars in there. Oh man. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's crazy. Yeah, candy. There yeah. you go. Yeah. Oh, and you got. got now this is your broccoli. Is that that's broccoli, See? romaine, and cauliflower, and one remaining pepper plant. Our broccoli never looked like that. Well, we yeah. never tried growing it in October either. No, is that when you're supposed to do it? You it's cool. It's spring or fall. Oh. Yeah. And ours bolted in the spring because it turned off hot really fast. Yep. Yeah. So we never got any. Oh, yeah. So yeah, that's what I'm we're trying, trying to. Get. <laughs> yeah. I have to, we have to get garlic planted. I oh, need yeah. it too, but can't find any to plant. No? No. Well, I don't know how late you can plant it, but I'll send you a half of mine because we have oh, way that'd more. Oh, be awesome. Yeah, I think it can still go in up to the end of October. I'm not positive, Is it? but I think so. All right. Maybe well, I'll, 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 send, I'll send some your way because it's the elephant yeah. garlic. It's the big stuff. You can do that one over winter, absolutely, because that's actually a leak. Yep. All right. Yeah. There that, you go. Isn't that what Jason told you to do? Jason uh, Cog Cog Hill. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I remember right. Over there, Autumn and Wyatt are quail, and we just got chickens that are ripe. Right Ooh. Ooh. Oh. So what is this? Ooh. This one is romaine. Oh yeah. I should see it. Notice. And I think it's one so of them bolted pretty. on the two hot days. Look at that. Oh yeah. Can you just snip that <laughs> off? Isn't that amazing? It's like two hot days. Yeah, and it changes everything. Instantly. Oh, let's go look at the quail. And those are from Kiffin Farm. Did you get, 
Are those your glasses you left at Billy's or? No, these are the old ones. The old ones? <laughs> I need to buy a new case to send him so he can ship my other ones back. There's one out. Oh, no. no There's like seven in there. What kind of chickens did you end up getting? Rhode Island Red. Oh, yeah. They're beautiful. Oh, you want to yeah. see them? Yeah. 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 Is a, a, a rooster is a Rhode Island Red. Oh, that's right. Yeah. What's his yeah. name again? What, Waylon Jr. Waylon, that's yeah. right. Yeah, we can definitely send you some eggs to to hatch. And if you guys get roosters, <laughs> if you get roosters, just just soup them. Just become oh, yeah. soup chickens. In town, we can't have roosters. They don't start crowing until they get big. I love this greenhouse. Pretty birds. Pretty birds. Hey, girl. It's a pretty bird. Yep. They look familiar. I don't know how I don't know how cold it gets here in uh, yeah. you guys' area, but up north when we had chicken coops like this, they put hay bales around the bottom to kind of insulate it, and you can leave them out here all winter. Yeah. Not very selling though. No. Oh, let's go check out their chickens. Oh yeah. That's a big one. What did you to eat? You might have to give them a little bit of room out here. Oh, I'm planning on it. I want to get a little wire fence around here. That's what I was thinking was an electric fence to give them more room. Yeah. yeah. Okay, now you can go in here. And... You won't believe how warm how warm it's going to be in there. Well, Should wait. be. Should be. Not much go, sun go, today, go, but it'll be warmer. Go, 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 go. Oh, it's yeah. much warmer. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot hotter, like when the sun is out. Oh these yeah. Peppers? These are okra, okra I'm saving for seed. The red burgundy okra that I got from a channel called Indie Yard Homestead in Australia. Mm. And oh, so I'm wow. saving the seed. That's what it looks like. Well, they're actually really, really red burgundy when they're normal. When they're, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I'm saving. You guys can take a big handful one. We don't do okra. No, I don't. <laughs> I, ate or, I, nope. had, I had some bad okra if that's, that's impossible. mint and this one is pineapple sage and if you've never smelled pineapple sage you've got to smell that. You yeah, want to, I just want to take a handful and eat it. It <laughs> yeah. smells so good. Yeah. And this one's sweet basil. Oh wow. We need to uh, take a leaf of that. It tastes like gum. Yeah. Yeah. It's take mint. a leaf and eat it. It's that's mint. the stuff we have on our property but hers is probably actually cleaner. As Where's in, ours? Not wild. Oh yeah, it does. T it does. It does, right? Is it? Yeah. It's, it's not your so kind of flavor gum, I can tell. <laughs> is, it, is, it, is it the hot gum? Don't like. Why is it so spicy? <laughs> it's no, spicy. really, smell this sage. It is amazing. So, what do you do with pineapple sage? Just use it like sage. I'm gonna That's rub it. it. Let it dry and rub yeah. it. Okay, not. Ooh. I guess, where does it get the pineapple name from? Pineapple sage. I guess I've never... I really don't know. It's just something Kyle picked up for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's and that's cool. just what it's called. Yeah, yeah, we cool need though. to. We need a greenhouse in our life. Because we do everything in our sunroom and it's just... Yeah. It's, 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 a it's not in the, the same. Butt. It's not. Oh, watch out for those snakes. Yeah, those are for <laughs> the birds that ate the crap out of my Roma tomato plants. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, they work. Still I learned it from them back here. My neighbor's back here. I wonder how Jason does that too. Puts those snakes out. Oh, there. does he? Yeah. I hadn't seen that. Well, she told me to do that because I'd gone over in her backyard. It's the only place I'd gone during the COVID, right? Yeah. In her yard to look at her stuff, and she told me she had snakes, and she told me they work. And I'm like, so I sent him after the snakes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the lady that was trying to help him find the snakes told said to him, "Oh, you must have a bird problem." And we're both going, "What? Everybody knew this, and we didn't." <laughs> well, I didn't know that. <laughs> well, we have a bird problem with uh, we're with our our raspberries so okay. we're gonna have raspberries we have a bird problem and then our blueberries and then our strawberries so the snakes are gonna work out yeah great way better. yep yeah. and see these up here i was telling jason at cog hill about those on my comment on his lap his greenhouse video yeah. those open automatically when it hits 70 degrees yeah that's just like the thermal it's um, like a honey material is what i'm told yep and when it heats up it melts and it opens them and then when it cools off it closes them Oh, that's cool. I actually have an extra box of them in the laundry room. I can let you take a photo and send to him. Yeah. Because yeah. I think he could, should put those on his. Yeah. So oh, yeah, he gets really hot down there, too. Yeah, chew on it. Yeah, <laughs> chew on it. If you don't like it. You don't like it? You can spit it out. You're not going to hurt her feelings. No, it's fine. It's good. Not everybody I mean, likes it's edible. You can't <laughs> 
What's that puppy? You taking care of all the weeds? You taking care of all the weeds? Huh? Oh. How did the, the self-wicking buckets work for you? I know. Too long. Like seven hours My table's good enough. Half hours. Yeah, we uh we took a wrong That's why turn. Sitting out here, so I didn't have to we took a wrong turn. We're used to going to Fort Worth, Texas, so we we're driving down the middle. Of, we're driving down the path in Nebraska to go down the middle of Oklahoma, and we wind up realizing this 50 miles into our trip. So we had a 50 miles back track to get back on, and we were we got into town down there like one, twelve thirty, one o'clock in the morning. And we were beat, and then we couldn't sleep. I didn't go to bed till two. I still couldn't sleep, and it was just. It was a long Saturday. Yeah. I can imagine. Yeah, we came down the Kansas side, and then and then Missouri, and then dipped in through the Turnpike over there. But then, uh, yeah, them people they they were they was a good time. It was a really good time. They uh, they stayed up they stayed up till like four in the morning. I heard so. I don't know. It was pretty crazy. That, that's not us. I got I was too I was too. I beat. can't imagine. Yeah, you were wiped out. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we just got back from Paula's we had a little bit of lunch had some great conversation and we are back on the road she actually gave us some what is it jewel corn jewel jewel corn uh-huh gem, gem corn gem corn we had gem corn and we uh I had tried some of that cowboy candy she sent us off with uh some of uh the salsa that she makes Kyle which I can't wait to try they're a little worried about that uh, cowboy candy with me eating it because they're like, ah, you're a wuss, you can't handle that stuff. But it was actually pretty good. It wasn't that bad, but yep. <laughs> she also gave us pumpkins. Yep, she gave each of the kids pumpkins. This one's mine. From the, the Workshire one. Project. And what did she say the other one was from? I don't remember. Oh, I don't either. Man, darn it, that's not good. We're getting back on the road.